Today's gonna be a great day, you know what I mean? About to do some errands right now, about to head to the bank. About to go get my cute ass best friend, Autumn. It's about to be a whole lot of getting shit, you know what I'm saying? And let's just turn the fuck up, you feel me? Hey, stay blessed, be happy, like and subscribe already, yeah, I know, you know what I'm saying? If you did, let's get it! So this dumb. There's this mirror at the bank, bro. That shit be getting people lit. That shit be getting my fucking lit, bro. I'll be in there anytime I come in here. Like, I'll be late. I'm gonna show you guys. No be rush. If you got it, you the do what you like. We're the girls. No the mind. We the vibe. 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 What be the vibe? We the vibe. What be the vibe? Three boys for front, five boys for back. Saturday night, tonight boys for knock. Are you sleeping on a bicycle or it's just a nap? When we touch the microphone, it's a rap. And I bought a thing on them. You make me bigger than all my enemies. Bad man wanna try me. Wait. You wanna come from hey. a band. I'm tough to be the end. I'm tough to be the end. I'm tough to be the end. Oh yeah. Scott a bad man, Scott a bad man. See my team, we are the baddest. Come in, in, come in, 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 me. I know they see nobody have it. Small money, where they, they go for wallet. No, they look me even if the camera be red, I know be carpet. You know be TV, no be callous. See the way you talking like you say your mother, know they show you manners. My vision, no be city, no be Dallas. Every day be pay, they be say we they kill you. Oh my God. <laughs> Definitely get your ass beat. Like the selfie here. I think it works well. Bruh! So first of all, how you put a tripod in here? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I put this and the tripod in my laundry basket. I found this, but not the tripod. <laughs> you want the tripod? <laughs> And she's so beautiful, guys. Look at that. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> she's so cute. This is my bad side. Oh, this. This, side. <laughs> this is my ugly side. You don't have an ugly side, you know. Everyone has a favorite side. Really? I ain't got none. Because you're beautiful, bitch. Ah, you got it beautiful. It's not a beautiful, bro. I'm fucking beautiful. I ain't even cute. I'm beautiful, nigga. Beautiful, nigga. I like, beautiful, you're beautiful. Beautiful, nigga. With, <laughs> <laughs> with double O's, nigga. <laughs> she trying to let me spend all my money on tripod. Just it's cause. Real. Tell your girl get it. <laughs> <laughs> Just cause she fucked up her tripod. She want me to fuck up my shit too. Why are your hands you long as shit though? Out. My finger, my hands small as hell. You got some long hands. That shit look like a mutumba. By the way, if you don't know what a mutumba is, don't worry about it. I'm gonna explain later in a, in a different video what a fucking mutumba is. <laughs> <All right. laughs> this video is not for mutumba. Uh, you need to put a parental advisory on this video. I need to put what? Parental advisory. <laughs> Yo, we have a 13 year old watching this. Hey, around fuck the house talking about that. Mutumba, you better have daddy. You got a mutumba. That'd be demonetized. <laughs> now you can put an age limit on it, though. Really? Yeah. I think it's I'm good. pretty sure you can put a. Uh, yeah. Okay. If I'm right. I'll be going ham like you. I'm going to just be doing makeup and shit. So. Yeah, guys, you got to check out her uh, YouTube page. Coming soon. AKA, uh, what is it? Coming soon at your uh, disposal. <laughs> Stop shit like that. 
some shit like that. You can do but a yeah. voiceover. <laughs> nah, I ain't gonna do no voiceover. I want an original, real shit, real dumb shit. Ah, she trying to kill me. Real dumb shit. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's coming soon. And can I, can, I, can, I, can I manage that? Yeah. I, I don't even know how to edit videos or nothing, so. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Cardi B gotta hire me for that shit. I'll be out there. I'll cut the mess. I hear you. She gonna make you pay money every time she you go. Sure like, Five dollars. Five dollars per. Taxes, my nigga. That's why you gotta come up with someone to be taxing. For real though. Mutumba, you can Mutumba. yeah, I got it. <laughs> and if you use Mutumba, it's 10 bucks, my nigga. Ooh, and tripping. I, hell yeah. Oh For the white people, it's 25, nigga. <laughs> Y'all rich ass niggas. Africans, it's $2. African Americans, niggas. For niggas, it's 10 bucks. For white people, oh 25. They got good credit. <laughs> yeah, so they can afford it. Yeah, they got credit yeah. cards and shit they can pay it on. So, you know, all them don't kill my ass, bro. So, when it's raining, you go five low. On a sunny day, you got five extra miles. If it's a little cloudy outside, you might get 10 extra miles because the clouds are so <laughs> <laughs> When it's nighttime, you just gotta take But they use the red out, though. They don't need to see you to get your ass, though. Hey, last time I checked, you don't even need a license to drive on a um, commercial road. That's a lie. No, that's the fucking truth, bro. Oh God, you know how you know how my media is still doing research about shit that people don't even ask about and shit. Yeah. And they were talking about how like you don't need a lenses and I, and there's actual fact because they have facts about um this guy that got pulled over by a cop. He was speeding and he the guy on uh, the cop asked for his license. He said he's he has his license but he's not gonna give it to him because that's a um. That's the commercial uh, commercial road, but he's in a private car. So having a private car, you don't need uh, a license. Only people that drive commercial vehicles are supposed to have licenses. But we get licenses because of for uh, identification. yeah, for identification and all that. So you don't really need a license to drive or a permit to drive. I was like, damn, I'm about to throw my shit away. Hell yeah, you know when they revoke your license for like driving? Yeah, that it's like. My, my car still worked though. My car still worked though. You know what I mean? And I was like, damn, so I got pulled over and my dumb ass did Oh, that was fun after I got pulled over. And I was like, looking up, like, yeah, look at that shit, like, damn. So if I'm speeding and all that, and then since then, it's like, you know what? I ain't even going to flex because I was like, going to speed your pulled over and throw that shit at a nigga, like, yo, in Attico, whatever, 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 bam, 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 bam. They don't even know what that is. They're just gonna be like. They really don't, cause this black dude got pulled over. Bro, seven cops came in deep. I was like, damn. And he was like, nah, I'm like, you can take me to court and all that, cause the Supreme Court ruled over pretty much every other court. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, like, they made this. Yeah, they, if if they make if they make that rule that you can drive a private vehicle without a. Uh, Without a license or a commercial license, then you straight. But there's a difference between state and federal roads. So like some highways. Are yeah, that's like, what I'm saying. Like you gotta know the streets, though. You can't just yeah. fucking drive on the road and be like, yeah, I, I'm gonna go like 50, and when they put me over, I'm like, hey, yeah. you can't put me over because this guy that I there, they are steady. But you gotta know the roads. You gotta know like what street you could do what on. I saw a street where it was like. Why the cops be taking away your tags? Like, my car still work? You think I'm about to drive that bitch? Because <laughs> some, some guy that um, I know that racist, he almost got pulled over. But because he racist, you know, he lands about all this type of shit. And he was like, if, if a cop try to pull you over, just like, you can stop. If you stop, you fuck. Because they cut you. Once they cut you in the act, you can't get a ticket. Yeah. But like, for him, he was about to get pulled over and he pulled up at a gas station. I just got out of the car. I just walked in the gas station. Like, did he? Like, he came to the gas station and the cop like sat right there, didn't do nothing. I was like, damn, you really didn't get a ticket? He was like, yeah, cause I wasn't caught in the act. Like, oh, you can go straight. That's so weird. You can go straight in there. Um, yeah. yeah. But but still right on them motherfucking no. Wait, that's like there's so many shit. Yeah.
Yeah, me too. I was like, damn, I should probably. But the thing is, is I feel like minorities and like black people in society are like scared to just try to exercise those rights because <laughs> cops will not care and they will like. That's facts, use though. That's facts. But but the thing is though, like now we don't even know who minorities are anymore because like it's mixed up now. Forget what I mean. Like you, there, don't get me wrong, there is minorities and all that. We could have went straight with me. There is minorities and all that, but at the same time, it's like, who is the minority, though? You know what I mean? Because well, I mean, like, there, there's some white minorities, because there's a difference between white supremacy and white privilege. Well, there's like, okay, but you have to say minorities, like, in social class and stuff like that. Yeah, like, like, but classes. me, at the end of the day, for me, I know for damn fact, like, nobody can cheat me on some shit like that. Because at the end of the day, I stay studying about my race. I stay studying and doing research about where I'm from and how things come about. You know this shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, so, not just not to brag or anything, but like, nobody's going to be able to come out a lot. You better come with the facts, bro. Because I know this shit. Like, you can't come with, to me and talk about, talk some shit about religion. Or like, or like uh, the world, or like science, or astrology, numerology, or shit like that, without the fucking facts. Cause I'ma hit you with some facts you don't fucking yeah. know. No, people hear shit once and they be talking out their ass. Yeah, <laughs> they be out there like, like, oh my god. Wait, I know, and it's like, oh, where you hear that? Well, I mean, I heard it somewhere. It's like, but you didn't like read it. Right. Like, like, right. Yeah. like you didn't even get to it. Like, like the word nigga. You know what I'm saying? People. People don't even understand, especially most black people don't understand the word nigger and what the name nigger or negro means. So when somebody say negro, they get pissed. But by, by the end of the day, you, you having somebody, a white dumbass nigga calling you a king or a queen, and you don't know that shit. Why? Because you haven't done your research about the word negro or where the word negro came about and how negro became black. Because Spanish came out of Latin. Latin came out of Greek. In Greek, the word Negro means more than more than the word Black in, in, in Spanish. So, like, if you don't do some type of research like that, and somebody said Negro or Negro, you just gonna be out there like, okay, you know what? This this nigga be racist or this nigga be that. Yeah, they might be being, they might be racist or whatever, but at the end of the day, bro. You've been called a, you've been called a king. You go on the wrong way, man. She don't, don't care, man. It's like, the thing is, is, yes, I understand that, but the way that the social construct yeah, of it society, and social though, connotation right, in society, not everyone's going to be like, <laughs> look at the root word of blah, 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 blah. Like, True, but, but. It's just, we know based off recent history because right. slavery and all that stuff was recent segregation recent as fuck people think it was long ago and it was for real though no, yeah it was so recent like there's still people alive today that had parents that were slaves and stuff and so it's just like True. when you have that it's like passed down through generation to be like this is what impacted my like family and right. like that's why like People do not feel comfortable with like others saying it and like just the kind I mean, of I mean, I, I get it. Like, you don't gotta feel comfortable. That's just my opinion. Like, you don't gotta feel comfortable with what the fuck I'm saying, bro. And hey, nobody better come at me on some shit about it, me talking about the wet nigga. Like, if you want, you can. Oh, yeah. Hey, some if you want, you like can slide up in my way. DM and I'll teach you. Like, I'll be glad to teach you what the fuck the wet nigga means and all that shit. Where you came up. Matter of fact, there's this guy on Instagram. Hey, I ain't getting paid for this shit. His name is called Lord Separate. Like, I'ma drop his fucking uh, link in the description below. Look up his shit, bro. He talks about all this type of shit. And it's like real fucking fact. Like, you know how we're talking about the first president of America the other time? Yeah. That I was talking to you about. And, uh, and it's crazy because like I came across it on his page too. But he was talking about other people. And also recently, recently I did about Africa and how the name Africa became, uh, we got the name Africa and all that. Like this morning I was looking off his page and he was also talking about that shit. 
So I slid up in his DM and I was like, yo, bro, this the same shit I be talking about. Like, this this what my brand, like my clothing brand is about. Matter of fact, hey, y'all go follow my clothing brand somewhere in Africa. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna learn a bunch of shit about Africa as a whole and being black, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> or being white. Whatever. But what we want what, what we about to do? We about to get what? We about to go to Whole Foods. <laughs> We're gonna continue. It's gonna be like Can't a be series, continue. A series. Yeah. But I feel yeah, we gotta do that shit. We yeah. Have a... Cause I majored in African studies and you just like on your own know just about it because you stuff. African and he be studying <laughs> So like we're gonna Why bring not? like the scholarly like yeah. this whole thing. Is that gonna be like a lifestyle or career? Th nah, that, that, that gonna be like a lifestyle video. We're gonna have it, we're gonna think about it. We're gonna we're gonna get into more details about that. But hey, if you like, if you wanna know more, you know, if y'all wanna fuck with type shit like that, if you live in Greensboro, and you know I'm saying and you wanna like you wanna learn more shit about that, like be open-minded and like know where the fuck your origins are from and all that shit. I'm down bro, like let's do this shit. Like, for real, like, let's get together and do some shit like that. But now, we gotta go fucking eat! Over the attic and in the Antarctic, dance all I win it, hear what? You know we say by force where we did do um It be African thing Africa me come from Just listen to the beers and the African chum Big nation a rock up the world Rock the world now 